And today in Blocks Fruits, I met these fake NPCs scamming noobs. And when I confronted the fake NPCs, things got intense. Oh man, another day in Blocks Fruits. And of course, you already know we got the drip face on. And honestly, I want to roll a fruit. So let's see what we can roll today. I'm feeling a bit lucky. Wait a minute. What the heck is going on over here? Player detected. Trade sequence begun. Huh? Hello, boop. Wait a minute. Is this dude pretending to be the gotcha? <laughs> There's no way. You are chosen amongst a few players who partake in an experimental feature. You are now able to trade with the gotcha. Bro, he's capping you cannot trade with the gotcha at all bro when this noob believes it i want to trade great let's begin now wait a minute what's going on what are they gonna do go ahead and spin a fruit when she's walking up to the gotcha the fake one and i think she's actually gonna roll a fruit don't do it boop don't do it and she just poured out a smoke fruit but let's see maybe the gotcha might be legit gotcha he might not be a scammer one now the trade system will engage system scanning bro and he's like scanning her fruit or something what's going on and why is boop so like okay with this when he took out the barrier fruit. All right, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little sketched out now. And he just asked her if she would like to trade. And Boop said yes. Okay, let's see the trade go down. What's gonna happen? All right, go ahead and drop your fruit. But it has to be near me. Oh no, what's gonna happen? Okay, I'll do that right now. And she just dropped him the smoke fruit. All right, let's see if the gotcha is gonna scam her or not. I hope not because low key, if that happens, I'm gonna feel bad for Boop. Trade ended. Wait, and he just put away the smoke fruit. Yo, give her the barrier, dude. Wait a minute. Huh? Where's my barrier fruit? Go away, noob. Bro, and the gotcha just scammed her. You're ruining my operation. Hey, I said give me back my smoke fruit. Uh, you're gonna blow my cover. I'm gonna have to deal with you now. Oh, shoot. And he just one-tapped her. All right, bro, that's it. I'm confronting this dude. Let's see if he's gonna scam me. Because if he does, he's not gonna one-tap me like her. I'm gonna one-tap him. Player detected. Oh, and he's trying to do the system thing on me. And I'm just telling him straight up to trade me. And he said trade sequence begun. And I'm gonna ask him what fruit he has for me. Clearly, this dude isn't an NPC. He's trying to act like one. Look, he's saying my name. Wow, you already know about this system. Well, I have this fruit for you. And he took out the barrier. And I'm gonna troll him. I'm gonna take out a leopard. Well, I have this fruit. And obviously, mine is better. So I'm not gonna even trade you. And look, let's see how this NPC reacts. And <laughs> look, he's like, wow, yes, that's a good trade. Wait, no. According to the system, this fruit has more demand. And now he's trying to lie to me. And he said that the trade benefits me too. Hmm. Well, let's see if you're the real gotcha then. And I'm about to hit him with the missile jab. Boom. Wait, the fake gotcha's trying to run away. Come back here, bro. When he's driving off with his boat. No. Oh, but I don't have fishmen before. I can't just go in the water. I'll die. But whatever, I'll let him get away. I'm gonna find him later anyways. But first, I gotta help out this noob. Boop, are you okay? Because I noticed you got trolled by a fake gotcha. No, I'm not okay. Well, how can I help? Do you want a fruit? Yes, please. And you know what? Since I'm nice, I'll give her a permanent fruit. So I asked her what permanent fruit she wants and to follow me we just arrived to middletown and she wants the permanent chop fruit because it's her favorite all right sure just wait in the boat for me i'm okay with that so now i'm gonna get to the permanent chop wait a minute there's another fake npc over here oh and it looks like they're doing the same method as the other dude hello timmy oh and timmy's the noob right here let's see how they do it this time would you like to have a guaranteed leopard fruit bro that's obviously cap and why are they doing it to noobs leopard isn't that the best fruit in the game yes it is and you can even have it permanently and all you have to do is drop me a fruit and i will give you your leopard does this fruit work yes it does okay i'll drop it and timmy just dropped in the fruit bro it should be obvious that npcs like that can't even talk why are these noobs falling for it wait a minute are they actually gonna give him the perm leopard this one looks legit it said trade completed wait a minute maybe this dealer actually isn't a scammer oh but timmy's still asking for the permanent leopard i don't think he got it when oh, they said that the trade was completed and to check the inventory and Timmy said, I checked it, but I don't see it. And the dealer just said, sorry, no refunds. Wait a minute. Did you really give it or did you scam me? Oh, wait. There's one more step before the process is completed. And she just killed the noob. And now the dealer just said, get scammed, dumb noob, lol. That's it. I'm confronting them. Why did you do that? Why are you scamming noobs? I know you're not an NPC. And look, they're trying to fool me. I'm not falling for this this time. Why are you doing this? What do you mean? I gave him his fruit. No, you didn't. You killed him. All right. You caught me. These noobs are so stupid. They always fall for our schemes. And they're laughing. Well, it's not cool to scam, you know. Especially the noobs. They need those fruits. And the dealer just said profit is profit in any shape or form. Well, you're not gonna get away with this because I'm gonna beat them up. Boom, and I got him in the dough combo. And I hit him with piercing clothesline. Boom. Oh, and I hit him up in the air, but they're trying to run away. No. And I'm trying to reach them, but I think they're too far. But it looks like they're heading over to the snow village. So I'm gonna grab the ship 
ship and head over there right now. Oh, and I forgot about this noob's chop fruit. So I just gifted Boop the chop fruit, but now we gotta go to their territory. It looks like they're all there in the snow village. And I told her that I gave her the chop, but we have to go. And I'm also gonna get the other noob to go with us. Timmy, I saw what happened. Follow me. We're gonna get revenge and don't ask questions. Okay. We just arrived at the snow village. I see them in that cave. And I told my new friends to stay here and I'll take it from here. Oh, and I'm walking in the cave now. Oh, and look, the gotcha's here too. He said, not a bad haul for today. These noobs made it real easy. Indeed. And look at the fruits in the middle. It's you again. Give the noobs back their fruits. How in the world did you find us? From that dumb dealer who ran away. That's how. Well, that's not happening. Those noobs were the dumb ones. And he just picked up the fruits. No. Give the fruits back. You gotta be quicker than that, buddy. Bro, and the dealer's laughing at me. Look, just give the fruits back. Not happening, big boy. Those noobs shouldn't have done that. They fell for it. It's their fault, lol. Come on. I'll do anything to get the fruits back, please. Yeah, sure. I'll give you them if you gift us both perm leopards. Dude, do they really think I'm about to give them perm leopards? Heck no. Well then, what if I beat you guys up for it? Then will you give them? <laughs> You're not beating us both. And plus, if you try to kill me right now, all these fruits will disappear from my inventory. So don't try and do something funny. And I already told you, give us perm leopards and you can have them back. How about if I beat you guys in a 1v1? Since you think you're so strong and the dealer's laughing at that offer. And what would I gain from that? I'll give you a permanent leopard. Hmm, one for both of us or no deal? All right, fine. But I already know I'm not gonna lose against them. Though they both have venom fruits. They're pretty strong though, I'm not gonna lie. Lol, get ready to lose 6k Robux. Meet us at the Coliseum, little boy. We're heading to the Coliseum now. And we're here at the Coliseum now. And Timmy just asked if I got the fruits. Not yet. I'm about to fight them. And if I win, I can get your guys' fruits back. Okay, good luck, Mr. Ominous. Please don't lose. I won't. And I'm pretty sure they just arrived here. They're over here. Are you guys ready? Who am I fighting first? Yeah, we're ready. And dealer, you can go first. You won't even need me, to be honest. All right, let's go then. And I'm fighting the dealer now. I'm not letting him live. Look at him jumping and stuff. Come here. Boom, and I just hit him in the pastry river. Oh, and they just transformed to the venom. They just use this toxic fog. I can't see anything. But I'm gonna just run out of it easy peasy because I'm super fast. And they're trying to hit me with all these venom moves, but that's not gonna work on me. And I'm getting them close. Boom, hit him with the piercing clothesline. Die! Are they still alive? Boom, and I hit him with the missile jab. They gotta be low down. And now it's game over for this venom dragon. And he's dead. Easy. What in the world? How? Well, you know, it doesn't matter. You probably got lucky. Hop on the pads, loser. Now I'm hopping on the pads. If I kill this dude, he's gonna die with the fruit. So we gotta be a little safe here, but I'm gonna kill him anyways. He's too easy. When he transformed into his venom. But I'm gonna hit him with my cursed dual katanas and just absolutely obliterate him. I'm using all my moves on him. He's gotta be low. Pastry river. Piers in close line. Oh, I missed barely. He's hitting me with all these venom moves. I just realized they both have venom, probably because they're toxic. But that won't stop me. Look at him trying to run towards me. He just ran right into my punches, bro. Die. Oh, and I'm low. I'm only at 3k HP. I just just realize they're gonna be pretty low but i just finished them off match over good game easy now hand over the fruits and i'm awakening mink v4 now because i gotta make sure they don't pull anything funny no i'm not giving you the fruits you had to have cheated you aren't getting any fruits drop them now no it's not happening shut up dear let's go oh shoot and they both just transformed into the venom well too bad i'm getting these fruits no matter what oh my gosh and i can't see i gotta get out of here when i see See them there's one right here and they're trying to hit me with all their venom moves oh my gosh it's so annoying fighting them of course it's two venom fruit users like so toxic oh but i got both of them in the piercing clothes like oh the double hit now hit him with the pastry river and the dough punches missile jab how are they not dead bro i just hit him with the el diablo and one just got out of his transformation i just sliced right through him and now i'm awakening mink v4 again they both untransformed i killed one there's one more left and it's time for them to die and they're dead dealer we lost the fruits let's server hop yeah we're out of here wait a minute i just realized i killed him with the fruits no bye losers and they both left the game i'm sorry guys they left and timmy's like are our fruits gone but it's okay because i'm gonna go get them some fruits now oh and there's an ice fruit right here here you go timmy you can have that and i rolled boop a spike fruit but she already got the chop fruit anyways perp there you guys go boop said yay and timmy is also very thankful well, at least I saved the noobs from the scammers.